Hello, Dennis Association, and hello, uh, Hollywood and Beverly Hills and media. Now, everybody knows that I have beautiful teeth, naturally. And uh, the history of this situation, this satellite man was trying to call my teeth fake because he was trying to call me some other race and some other person's child, which I am not those people's relative. I am not their child. My DNA does not match theirs. And my mother had court cases against the Ray family before. And my mother had a lot of the people in the Ray family in the courtroom back in the 80s. Is that not true? Look up that information. Now, that's one subject of information. But, you know, this man that is the satellite controller is trying to claim that he's the pig in space. If you're in the FBI or CIA or any drug enforcement agency or anything, you're able to look up a database of my identity. And hello, British intelligence. And in reference to documents of Albert Broccoli, too. Yeah, you, know, you have the information about Albert Broccoli and and Howard Hughes, and Doris Duke, and George Vanderbilt, and Andrew Carnegie information, and John D. Rockefeller information. You have all that information, right? And John Paul Getty information, government freak. Do you have any of that information on record, faggot? Dirty psycho government faggot? And all your impersonators have to get DNA tests, man. And the Chinese and Japanese and Koreans and English and French and Italians and some other countries have to look at the DNA of the race of your impersonators. Just about all those countries have already seen my DNA. They've already seen my rare blood type. And in reference to uh, documentation of my family history, and my DNA type, and the fact that they have to check the DNA type of some of those famous historic names of people. Like they need to know, I guess you'd say, what the DNA type of John D. Rockefeller is, the DNA type of Doris Duke, the DNA type of Andrew Carnegie, the DNA type of Howard Hughes. The DNA type of George Vanderbilt. The DNA type of John Paul Getty. And we're going to see who you are, government man. And some other particular names. And hello in reverence to Mozart and Beethoven uh, uh, music and people in, uh, you know, offices of things. Lots of things of importance. But in reverence to government man. And your activities of your tricks, whoever you are, you need to go into court, man. And the United Nations needs to find out what your DNA is because they got to tell the whole world who you criminals are. You're still hitting me in the teeth like you thought you owned somebody's upper lip. Did you call my face fake, man? Did you call my teeth fake? I think you need to go into court, government man. You better quit burning holes in my teeth and gaps in my teeth. My dental records show there's absolutely no gaps in my teeth. What do you think you're doing? Trying to put your shit stink on other people's teeth, man? Trying to shit mouth America, government man? Trying to shit mouth people in this fucking country? I think you need to go to court and I think there should be you know, warrants out for you where you're wanted dead or alive, satellite man. You better go into court. And if you're in the CIA or FBI or any branch of government and you've been doing this to me, you're going to have to get put on trial. You're trying to accuse me of things, government man. W what kind of symbolism is that? Because the American Dentist Association does not approve of your symbolism of what you've done to my teeth, man. And neither would my mother and father. And, you know, I always go along with the facts of who my parents are and 
who I am, not your forgery Greenfield document either. You know, all the Ray family people's DNA is on record, right? Mine does not match anybody in the Ray family. And there was court cases about these people kidnapping me from California. They were the people that kidnapped me was relatives of the Ray family. A couple of them, I guess, was you know entertainers or something. But since then, those people have been blackballed from Hollywood and the media. And then those people had kidnapped me from. They got kid. These people got uh, blackballed. Because of their actions and activities of them harassing other celebrities. So these people was trying to fake their identities and slandering my character as their way of trying to get back into Hollywood. When these people got blackballed from Hollywood, whoever these people were that kidnapped me in their Helter Skelter games. And them trying to slander my beauty. It's attempted murder what they're doing. They're still hitting me right there, man. Right, right, to, right there. They're hitting me right there. And it's hitting those teeth right there. Now, roll protocol shows absolutely no dents or gaps in my teeth. And it shows all my teeth are real. Again, he's going to court, man. There's pictures of the evidence of the damage. Where's my lawsuit monies? I need it immediately so I can move away from Indiana. And in reference to California, I don't know why California didn't come over and demand these people to go into court for their sex crimes and abuses with their satellite terrorism and their mutilations. You think you're popular because you did that to my teeth? What's that a symbol of, you freak? What's the symbol of the damage of the upper teeth too, man? And that motherfucker would say something like, oh, that's something for them to know and you to find out. No, 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 because there's protection laws. American Dentist Association protection laws. It says, stop doing that. Do you know what kind of seriousness you've done? When you've done something to somebody's teeth, man, that makes their whole life look like uh, something stupid. When you've done these things, man. And when you and when somebody's a, a high class person or a famous person, and these people cause damage on them, they they try to add damage to things. Now you see that satellite melts teeth, real teeth, damages real bones. That satellite microwave stuff. Yeah. Do you know how long it's going to take for my teeth to heal from what you've done, man? You better answer the question. You better go into court and answer a lot of questions, man. Somebody might order military strikes on your government agency. Then now you're going to call me the bad guy, huh? But it might be the Treasury ordering military strikes on your satellite controllers. You're violating American policies. You've done damage. I've been injured by dirty government CIA people before. And FBI criminals, people that are in the FBI that are criminals that have terrorized me. Or if it's the Middle Eastern Nazi criminals of the CIA or FBI. Or whoever you are. They can order military strikes. There's pictures of the evidence of the damage. My teeth are documented as beautiful of my race and religion and American history. And you need to get prosecuted for trying to damage American history, government man. You need to go to court, freak show.